Hello, it's Sarah. And today I just wanted to share my two-tone Pandora bracelet. It's kind of filled up. And I think I have one or two other beads that I'd like to get for it. But for right now, I think I'm pretty good. I have three Muranos on here. And I like it. Like, I, I always had only silver charms on my old bracelet. But I'm liking adding the Muranos. This is the... Um, Signature two-tone. I'm just open it up. I don't have um, a safety uh, safety chain bead thing yet, and I might not. I'm not sure because I like it when this type of bead doesn't have the um, like the threading inside of it, so it can go over the threading, so it like goes right up against it. I guess the safety chains can be like spun onto it too. So I'm not sure. I haven't really thought about that. I'm still collecting. I think I'm pretty good with most of the names. I'm going to zoom in. And let's get started. Hopefully that will focus. And it kind of all started with this charm. This is the Vintage Heart, I believe. I've kind of written down some of the names but I got this one for Christmas so it's all it's five months in and I've collected these over that time this is the vintage heart with two-tone but I think it also comes with gemstones in the middle I'm not positive um, this one is the seashell let's see I'm, I'm gonna um, make sure seashell and starfish I'll cross them out as I go seashell and starfish and I had that one on my old bracelet. I had a Pandora bracelet years ago and it got stolen so I I don't know but I love this charm and I would recommend it. It actually I got this at the outlet so it's still it's newly retired. This one's not retired yet. I, I don't know if it's newly retired but the Pandora outlet still had it so it's always nice to find them there because especially the two-tone ones are a little bit higher in price just in general. Um, so, all right, then the next one is, I don't, I think it's called Flower Garden, and it's just the pink Flower Garden. It has a white core to it, so I just like it because it's soft colors, and I think pink and gold go well. But I have other Muranos. These are just the three that I've chosen to put on this one, and I may, it may not stay that way, but we'll see. I mean, if I collect more beads, uh, the Muranos might have to get on another bracelet because I want to load this one up you know uh, this dangle I got at the outlet too it's called the Ma magnificent heart dangle I think not positive but um, it has little CZ's on the bail part of it and then the heart is all gold and it's just like a cut out like a laser cut gold heart um, and I think that's retired too that may be newly retired but I did get that one at the outlet uh, this one is called Stitches, I think, Cross Stitch. The Cross Stitch Charm, definitely on, it's definitely clearance. I mean, not clearance, retired, duh. But I love it because it has a lot of gold. Like, when I'm choosing beads for this, I'm tending to go with for ones that have a lot more gold presence on them. So not ones with just a little tiny heart. Um, eh, you can't, you know. Uh, but anyway, this one... I just love it. And this was one of my, these two are the two most expensive ones I've gotten so far. And I've gotten them both on eBay. I think this one was 85 for one bead. And then I just got this one today. This one's called the Beehive Charm, I think. And it has two gold bees on each side. And it's a bee skep. And I love it so much. And this is, I want to say this has been retired a while. But that might just be like since... 2015 so I don't know if that's a while but you don't see it I, I haven't seen it very often at all so I actually did my first um, eBay what is it like uh, I bid on it and I won but the other all the other ones I've gotten on eBay I've just bought it now they have a price called buy it now so you just pay the price they want it for and some of them have an auction and you have to bid on it and so I did win this one I didn't win there's one other one that I want really bad it's the dragonfly the gold dragonflies it's just a round bead with four golden dragonflies on it and 
I really like dragonflies. Um, but anyway, that one is on my wish list, so that definitely could be added. I just want to get it for a decent price, like under a hundred. I'm kind of debating because you can buy it now for one twenty-five. I think it's listed for, but I just feel like I am very frugal. And I like to get things for as cheap as I can. But I did get the bee scap and I love it. I love bees and critters and dragonflies. And I just love it. So, alright. This is called the braided heart clip, I think. Um, just look on here and make sure. Braided heart clip, yeah. Um, and it's a big one. I got this at the outlet too. And it was really a good price. Because I think when it was regular, like um, not retired. Because this is retired. It was... Oh, it might have been over a hundred bucks or it was close to a hundred bucks um, so I think I got it for at least half that around 47 I want to say at the outlet um, this was a great deal on eBay because this is a new charm this is the signature heart dangle but it's the two-tone see the heart so that's the bracelet is the signature round but this is the heart, and I think I got this on eBay for like 20 something dollars, which I think it's still available. I'm just looking at my eBay. $28.95 with free shipping. So I got that because I just love it. I think it's a hunk of gold. It's a hunk, I mean, a hunk of bead. It's big. It's pretty decent size, and it's got a lot of gold. So um, I thought that was a great deal. And yeah so I mean I think that's not even retired either so you can still get that and um, I think it goes for like $85 so I don't know look around you guys and it's it's the real deal and even if it's not it looks real deal to me I mean there's the 925 and the ALA which is on all the Pandora charms it says Pandora around the heart so I'm I'm happy <laughs> This one is called the Majestic Heart, and I love it. Got that on eBay, too. Let me see how much that one was, because that's definitely retired. $39.99. That's, like, kind of, that's a really decent price, because for a two-tone bead, they generally aren't that low. I mean, like, when they're new, they're definitely not. So, I love it, and it's on both sides, and then there's a little CZ in a heart. Like, there's a little heart right there with a CZ in it, and it's just a, it's a pretty decent size bead again. I'm trying to stay in the shot. I have to watch what I'm doing. So that's the Majestic Heart. This is a really, I, I don't know, I think it's Flower Garden again, but it has these little CZs in the middle of the flowers, and I just love this Murano, so it stays on here because I love them. This little carriage, there's two carriages, and this is, um, I think the other one might be two-tone, too. I'm not sure. Um, this is called the Royal Carriage. The other one, I think, is called Cinderella's Carriage. This is older, and I think it's retired, but it has a gold crown with a tiny little pearl inside of it. And there's also a little person in there inside the carriage on both sides and I just really like it and it makes me happy but the thing is I may end up putting these two particularly I have a couple other kinda I, I love the unicorn and like I might make a fantasy bracelet too of not just all two tone so these two may go on another um, bracelet at some point because I want to get the frog I'd like to get um, the unicorn, uh, maybe the queen bee. Like, there's a couple different things that have to do with more like crowns. Um, so let's see. This is called the royal carriage. That's called the fairy tail dangle with the little fairy, and she's holding a wand. And that's my hubby. He's just on his way home. And she has a little tiny heart on her belly, and that's gold. But see, that's what I mean. There's not a lot of gold on her, so I would probably change this one out for something with a little bit more gold. But for right now, she's awesome, and these two go together on there. Then I just got this clip. This is called Heart of Love Clip. And it is just has love the script love written in gold on one side so on the other side it's plain 
but I still liked it. I liked it because I don't like to repeat. A lot of people do um, repeat beads, and they like to have, uh, you know, two of each at least, or I just prefer to have all different. I like to have all different. That's just my preference. So I got a heart here, and these are my two clips. So I have a heart, braided heart clip, and then this heart with the love script. This is called Family Forever, I'm pretty sure. And this is not retired, but I did get it on eBay again, I'm pretty sure. Actually, no, I got this at the outlet. But it's not retired, so it wasn't reduced price. It was the full price. I think it was around 55 I don't remember. I don't remember all of them. Um, let's see. The next one is called either Interlocking Hearts of Love or interlocking love I don't know but this is the two-tone version so one of the hearts is silver and the bottom one is gold and I think I got this one at Jared when I bought this bracelet I don't remember it's a blur sometimes I go in the store and I can't you know I, I walk out of there with stuff not walk out of there with stuff I buy it but <laughs> Anywho, I love it because it's so blingy and it's a nice amount of gold. Like you see a lot of gold. That's a big heart. The next one is, again, a flower garden bead. I don't know what it's called, but I just loved the soft pinks and greens and a little bit of white and then the red in the background. It's just really, really pretty in person. Um, I think I got it on eBay. I'm not positive. This one I definitely got. No, I got this at the outlet. This was marked down. Again, a really good score. This was like under $50 for the, it's called, um, something star. Let's see, Golden Stars. I think it's called Golden Stars. And if you look at it, these stars are big gold stars. There's three. One, two, I think there's three big gold stars on there. And I'm not necessarily a star person. But I love, I have another um, clip with stars on it. And st who doesn't, I mean, stars are good. It was more hearts. I'm more hearts than stars. But I love this bead. It's, I think it's one of the older beads, and it's really chunky. Then the last one is called Heart Lock and Key. So the lock, and I got this one for Christmas too. The lock is silver, has a little chain, and so I consider it a dangle because the chain at the end of the chain is a little gold key with a heart so it's two-tone not you know but I might end up I could put that one I'm gonna go up a little bit I could put that one and these two on a different bracelet because they're not there's not a ton of gold on them I want to go with the more so like I said the dragonfly bead is so it's so awesome and so I really want that on here. So things will have things will get moved around eventually. But I figured I think I'm gonna be good for now, although my birthday is this month. So I probably have another bead in my future. We'll see. Um, so yeah, I'm in love. I love it. I wear it pretty much every day. I haven't been wearing the pink one as much um, because my my wedding band is kind of two-tone I have the two to I have the white gold prong set diamonds and then the gold so I actually wear this on my left wrist all right you guys so that's it this is a 7.1 as well and I'm thinking I'm gonna put it on if I can I'm thinking that I may go down a size I think there's a six point something like close to seven that I might try if I do get another bracelet at some point because I'll show you. And I mean, I've lost weight, but it hangs like, and then when it goes down my wrist, it comes down. So I think I have room. I can still fit like two fingers under here. So we'll see, although I guess on a smaller bracelet, you won't be able to fit as many beads. Aha. Uh -huh. But anyway, I do love it, and I'm a dangle fan. I love dangles because one of the other things that got stolen was I had a 14 karat charm bracelet that was all charms. It was just the charms that hung off the, um, like a, a, a curb link bracelet, I guess. It's like a curb link chain, 
and then you just attach your charms to it and it was all gold so that got stolen but I have always lo I love the dangly this of these charms so all right you guys thank you so much for watching